Today marks the anniversary of West Manor's darkest time, Valentine's Eve. The hotel has been closed since last Halloween, and Eve Valentine is dead. The people of Willington hope today passes by quickly so they can get back on with their lives. You all right, Jason? Yeah, just a tough day. Not the anniversary I was looking forward to, really. It's nearly over. Yeah, well, it can't come quick enough, really. Just wish the Chief Inspector was about. He's still on his extended leave. I'm not sure about this. Are you scared, Alex? No, I'm nervous, but I could lose my job, and uh, I've got your early access to this. Sorry, I'm late. Sorry, what? They haven't changed the locks. No, Lan. Well, sometimes security come and do checks. Maybe they've just forgotten to turn it off. Maybe you switch it off. Not funny. enough to do this job.
Valentine's Eve, and we are locked in one of the country's most famous hotels. This is friggin' awesome. What was she like? Chloe, I mean. You mean, did I realise she was a homicidal mania? Well, if you put it like that. No. She was always so calm and collected. That's what makes it so scary. Let's go to room 18. No, no chance. chance. Come on, I dare you. I can't believe you talked us into going into room 18. <laughs> I've left my car keys and I'll be right back. Oh, I wouldn't say that. Oh, no, <laughs> give it a rest. Why are we doing this? Why Valentine was dead. <laughs> Ian Valentine is dead. <laughs> Are you sure about this? Yeah. But shouldn't we check on Emily? Oh, she'll be fine. I'm gonna get a selfie. Natalie, behind you! storm has hit the Durham area and people are advised not to travel. Gemma? I thought you were dead. What's going on? It's not what it looks like. She made me do it. Where's Anne? She made me. I had no choice. Who made you do what? what what's happening? How's the shoulder? You look like you've seen a ghost, Jason. On Halloween night, I arrived early. And after a near miss with a rag dolly, I bumped into Eve. She offered me a lifeline. Help me or die. Easy choice. Quick summary. Jenna switched me with someone who had previously got in my way. Someone who wouldn't be missed. Let's just say that. Bulletproof vest saved me and then Jenna got me back on my feet. The problem is, <clears throat> I don't need her now. What are you doing? What did you do that for? You have a dilemma, Jason. 
Frame Jenna or I kill Anne. You know, your daughter. How, how long have you known? It's irrelevant. You have two choices. E. Valentine copycat Jenna. She panicked and killed herself. Or you send out the search party for me and I find you and I kill you and your family. You horrible bitch. Good choice. Bye, Jason. Jenna, Jenna, talk to me. Come on, Jenna. Oh, shit. Officer Reid, I need, I need backup. The West Manor, and an ambulance. Somebody's been stabbed. Quick. There are reports coming in of a serious incident at West Manor. Police are on the scene, and we will update you as soon as we can. Chief Constable. Yes. Yes, I'm fine, thank you. Yes, I've been enjoying my leave, but that's why I wanted to speak to you. I know I'm on extended leave, but um, I would really like to come back into the office if I can. Yes, you're okay with that? Thank you very much. Thank you. Okay. Bye bye. But there were stranger things pulling in the wrong direction Now I see you're the master of manipulation Of my depression, I learned my lesson, baby Your bites will stand your book The time's changing I'm free and out of the dark You don't face me To say you're off your rocker It's kinda way You said we're far from ordinary You killed my heart 
Cold blood like a mercenary You kinda scare me I very nearly feed it I'm cutting you out of my life I love autopsy Just a